चंद्रयान की सक्सेस के बाद देर हैज बीन लॉट ऑफ स्पेकुलेशन इन द मीडिया अबाउट द पॉसिबिलिटी ऑफ इसरो सेंडिंग अ ह्यूमन इन टू स्पेस मे बी इन द नेक्स्ट डिकेड और सो Uh, I'm आई एम नॉट रियली श्योर अबाउट द ऑथेंटिसिटी ऑफ दिस पर्टिकुलर पीस ऑफ इन्फॉर्मेशन बट एवर सिंस आई हैव बीन गेटिंग क्वेश्चन आफ्टर क्वेश्चन क्वेरीज आई हैव बीन बॉम्बार्डेड विद क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम पेरेंट्स एंड स्टूडेंट्स हाउ डू आई बिकम एन एस्ट्रोनॉट वॉट डू आई नीड टू रियली स्टडी टू बिकम एन एस्ट्रोनॉट और गेट इन टू इसरो सो दीज आर सम ऑफ द क्वेश्चन दैट आई हैव कम अक्रॉस फ्रॉम पेरेंट्स एंड स्टूडेंट्स सो आई थॉट वाई नॉट मेक अ वीडियो टू आंसर दिस पर्टिकुलर क्वेरी सो लेट स्टार्ट विद बेसिक्स who is an astronaut an astronaut is a person trained by a space agency to command pilot or serve as a crew member of a spacecraft astronauts are highly trained individuals who have undergone rigorous physical and mental preparation to be able to work in the challenging environment of space to so gear up in case you want to really become an astronaut you will have to really gear up and give your best astronauts are responsible for a wide range of duties depending on the specific mission they are assigned to astronauts may be involved in a variety of space related activities including exploration research repair and maintenance missions it doesn't mean that astronaut means somebody who just flies to space and uh, collects some samples and comes back so this is a common misconception uh, that people have so there is one more term that you would have come across commonly called cosmonaut so who is an astronaut and who is a cosmonaut an astronaut and a cosmonaut are essentially the same thing both terms refer to people who are trained to work in space the term astronaut is used by space agencies in the us whereas the other term is generally used by the russian space agency so next sawal aapke man mein ye hoga ki astronaut karta kya hai i mean is he just getting into a rocket and uh, just flying off to space collecting some samples from there and just coming back astronauts are responsible for operating and maintaining the various systems on the spacecraft including the life support systems propulsion systems and communication systems they may also be involved in conducting scientific experiments to so, jaise aapke man mein hoga ki wo ja ke sample collect karke aata hai so that could be one of the work so and he might be uh, doing some experiments there itself many space missions involve conducting scientific experiments in microgravity astronauts may be responsible for setting up and conducting these experiments as well as collecting and analyzing the data so they might collect a few samples or do some research there itself to check the outcome next uh, astronauts may also be required to perform space walks so these are called extra vehicular activity or eva to repair or maintain equipment on outside of the spacecraft we will also discuss about communicating with the mission control so astronauts are in constant communication with the mission control and are responsible for reporting on the status of the spacecraft and any problems that may arise so now coming to the most popular question that i have come across how do i work as an astronaut with isro so before getting into the astronaut thing i would also recommend that you research about the broad career opportunities that you can have in space tech and also within within isro itself it is important to note that becoming an astronaut is a demanding and competitive process and individuals who are selected for astronaut training and missions typically have a strong background in stem that is science technology engineering or mathematics and may have even advanced degrees in these areas so to become an astronaut with the isro you will need to meet the following requirements earn a bachelor's degree in engineering or a related field such as physics or mathematics a master's degree highly preferred next have at least 3 years of professional experience in a related field some experience will help although they might be hiring freshers fresh engineering graduates as well three this is open only to indian citizens number four you should be in good physical and mental health with excellent vision number five you should meet the requirement the height requirement to apply you will need to fill out an application form and submit it to isro you may also be required to attend an interview and undergo medical and physical tests if selected you will then undergo astronaut training so these are just a broad guidelines for specific information uh, i recommend you visit the isro site and uh, get more details now what does a career as an astronaut entail a career as an astronaut can be extremely rewarding as it allows individuals to make significant contributions to the field of space exploration and to advance our understanding of the universe however it is also a demanding and competitive field with only a small number of people being selected 
to become astronauts. Now I've come across a few questions from parents who are also uh, concerned about the risks in the work of astronauts. Obviously it's a natural concern as a parent. So being an astronaut involves a number of risks and potential hazards. Some of the risks may be risk of injury or death during launch or re-entry. The process of launching a spacecraft into orbit and returning it back to the Earth is complex and dangerous. There have been several accidents in the history of space travel that have resulted in the loss of life. The risk of space debris. Spacecraft and astronauts can be damaged by small pieces of space debris, such as old satellite parts or other debris that is orbiting the Earth. You also run the risk of radiation exposure. Astronauts are exposed to high levels of radiation than people on the Earth due to the lack of protection provided by the Earth's atmosphere and magnetic field. This can increase the risk of developing cancer and other health problems. The risk of physiological effects are also there. Long duration space travel can have negative effects on the human body, including changes in the bone density, muscle atrophy and vision impact. Being in space for extended periods of time can be isolating and stressful, creating psychological problems also, such as depression and anxiety. However, despite these risks, most astronauts consider the opportunity to participate in space exploration to be worth the potential dangers. They are highly trained professionals who are well prepared to handle the challenges of space travel, and they always look forward to that excitement. It's important to note that the astronaut selection process is very, very competitive and only a very small number of applicants are finally selected. However, there are many other rewarding careers in the field of space exploration, such as working in mission control, developing new technologies, or even teaching about space. So do consider them as well while exploring career opportunities as an astronaut.